Good freaking morning. Saturday morning. What is it? Monday? I uh, came down sick. I'm finally feeling like I got my energy back again. Uh, I felt better Wednesday, but Thursday, Wednesday, I felt better because I was like breaking my fever. And then Thursday, I felt like crap again because I had no medicine in me and like because I don't have a fever anymore, now I stopped taking medicine and, or the, you know, uh, fever medicine, Tylenol. So I got all my body aches back and that sucked. Friday, yesterday was kind of a transition day and today I woke up and feel really good. So I'm ready to get back at it. I lost my freaking smell this morning. And I know that because I shoved my nose in a bottle of minced garlic and went, and couldn't smell anything and it blew my wife's mind but it's coming for her soon because it actually got the rest of my family and they're about a day behind me so anyway um i'm ready to get back out in the real world it's been officially five days and uh yeah i'm gonna go get my hair cut because i think it's time what do you think the best way to tell it's gonna be a good day is when you see the sun shining there it is. Hard to beat a good old sunny day. It's actually not that cold out here. It says it's in the 30s. But I guess with the sun shining, it makes it feel a lot warmer. So, good sign. Man, I feel so much better. Nothing a little haircut can't fix, I'll tell you what. All right, so now it's 11.30. Still got like half a day left. The craziest part is I'm trying to find things to do, but there's really nothing to do. So we're doing a little experiment now to see if uh, I truly have lost my smell, which I have. And so the first thing we did was pine saw, and now we're doing the ultimate test. Let's see if we can, this is minced garlic. Nothing. I got nothing. I could I could breathe this all day. I can't smell it at all. Oh, that's so it's weak. wild. This is here, Lana, you try it. Can you smell it? Stop. Can you smell it? Yes. It smells disgusting. Yeah, exactly. Right. Well, we found one thing to do today. We're out at this camp uh, where I live, and we're pressure washing this basketball court. Yeah, we're about a quarter way done, but it looks really good. So, still a beautiful day outside. You ready, dude? We're gonna ride down here to this pond and see if we can't fish a little bit before we get back home. Well, we didn't catch anything. It's a beautiful lake, though. Huh? I found a fishing pole. <laughs> what? Fishing yeah, we gave it back, though. Yeah. You gonna ride your bike home? No, you're not. You gonna take yeah. it on the highway? Yeah. All right, let's go home. Hey, dude. What you doing, buddy? What are you doing? Are you so excited? Are you so excited? With you. We stand. No, you just want dog food. We stand. Oh, buddy. Okay, go back inside. Okay, go back inside. Go. Wait a second. Go. Inside. Go. Go. Before we wrap up this video, I've got an idea. Oh, let me get up in the truck. No, my idea is not to just clean my third brake light. There's a reason I'm doing this. So I don't know if you guys know this, but my wife and I have a vinyl decal business. We've had it for probably four years now. It's called All the Vinyl and uh, make car and truck decals and things like that and sell them on eBay. And one of our most popular items is a uh, rear like sliding window flag for the Silverados and Sierras. It goes in your sliding glass window and it's like a matte black um, American flag. It's really cold outside. Anyway, so we make these flags. 
So we make these flags right here and we sell them on eBay. And we also make like horsepower stickers and we make just all kinds of cool stuff. I've got a cool idea for another decal for these new trucks. All right, I whipped up a design real quick. Proceed with cutting. Let this thing work its magic. We'll see how it comes out. So we sell these things here for the 2016 to actually the 2022 Camaro. And you can see we've sold quite a bit of them, 186 of them. And why can't we do that for the new trucks? Check this out. Duramax, or it can say whatever you want it to say. Just like the Camaro, you can put your text in it. So we're gonna go slap this on the truck and see how it looks. So it goes over the third brake light, and you can see I've got one up there right now, just a black sticker, and you can't hardly even tell it's there. So when you get up closer, you can see it. I'll go ahead and peel that off. It's, this is a little bit small, I just did that as a test. Oh, you can see how cold it is, it's like ripping the vinyl. All right, so we got it off. Look at this. I think that's gonna look sick. So this thing has a hidden feature. It's actually clear where you see white here. So when I put this on, uh, the purpose is when you hit the brakes, it should light up the word Duramax. And on these trucks, the third brake light is actually just right here in the middle. These two on the side are cargo lights, so they don't actually light up the same. So it should look pretty cool. So there you go. It's installed. Really pretty subtle. Oh God, what a jump. Oh, you can see from down here, you can kind of see it. It's nothing too crazy. Now we gotta hit the brakes and see what it looks like. That's freaking sick, I like that. All right, so we're gonna leave that up there. And now that I like it, it's gonna become another item in our eBay store, which I will drop a, a link in the description below to the eBay store where you guys can check it out. And I'll actually, to help get this thing going, uh, I'm gonna give away one of these. So whatever you want it to say, I'll have to come up with how many letters it'll hold because obviously it's only so wide. And uh, whatever you want it to say, I'll ship it to you. I just need you to comment on this video. And uh, let's see, I'll upload this video tonight. So I'll give it 24 hours and um, pick one of the comments and we'll ship you out one of these. And I'll also do an Instagram post. So head over to my Instagram, at Lehman Griffin. And uh, I'll put a post up on there, same thing. And if you comment on that, like and follow my page, then uh, you'll get one of those too if you win. So check it out, it's a pretty cool mod, pretty simple. It's gonna be pretty cheap. I think it's cool. All right, that's it for me guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video today. It was really just a bunch of nothing. I'm just feeling good. I'm finally over this sickness. So I wanted to get out and about and do something. And uh, we did as much as we could. So we'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.